All right, guys, we're here with Eric Nordby, the owner of The Little Belgian. Eric, tell us what makes this place unique and also what you love about Auburn. Well, as far as the deli goes, um, I like to refer to it as uh, cutting edge and old school. So um, we've been using all natural meats since the day we opened. Uh, no nitrates, no MSG, no growth hormones. Um, we try to source locally. We like to support other local businesses. Clean with only organic uh, cleaners here. Part of the, you know, cutting edge and old school is that our menu is very unique, uh, but we do have some old school techniques on how to prepare things. So French dips, uh, we make uh, our juice from scratch every day. Um, our stuffed avocados have become kind of a legend, um, and you're seeing that throughout the United States now on Pinterest and Facebook and other, other restaurants are now serving them. Ours are, you know, the famous has got whipped cream cheese, black pepper, garlic seasoning, crushed smokehouse almonds, um, wasabi and sriracha sauce and razor fresh jalapenos, which gives it this, you know, almost like sushi in a cup. And we've got four different uh, avocados for people to choose from. When we open this place, you know, we're, we're predominantly West Coast craft over there. Um, my life before Auburn, I was a uh, beer broker. And so I did marketing consultation for breweries. Uh, and some of those were Belgian breweries. So I would set up their distribution. And so when I first looked in the window here, when I saw the for rent sign, and I had realized it had been a deli and it was a lifelong dream for me to have a deli, I wanted to differentiate the pub from this place. And uh, because I had all of that experience in Belgian beers, they're great food beers, uh, they're great social beers, they make you kind of giddy like champagne. Uh, Belgian beers come in little five gallon kegs, so I knew I could get a pretty good selection in a smaller space because I knew I'd be sharing that space with the food we would need to do here. Uh, we since, uh, put in this other secondary cooler here so we could have even more Belgian beers. And of course, West Coast Craft is super popular. So what I realized pretty quickly is I had seven, seven Belgians and seven West Coasts. I needed more West Coast uh, to make people happy, but they also maybe drink a few of those and then have a Chimay Grand Reserve or a Great White. Mm. And it's just fun to pair uh, the Belgian beers with different foods. So um, what I love about Auburn is very outdoorsy. Uh, I think Auburn blends that safe environment for me to raise my children in. We've got great schools. We've got great people. Uh, as you guys know, and, and I applaud you for doing what you're doing, is we've got a bunch of uh, small businesses in here. I, I'm an avid fly fisherman, so we have, uh, over at my other business, World Pub, we have a fly fisherman's club. I can get out in the river on my day off uh, within 30 minutes and be fly fishing. Um, you know, I love it that everybody else can go out and do what they love, which is hiking, biking, all the endurance athletes, to bring those things to town, you know, whether it's an endurance horse race or biking or uh, running down from Tahoe. I look at those people, I'm like, whoa, this, this is amazing. Uh, so we have, it encapsulates all of that. Mm -hmm. And we've got clean air, clean water, just the perfect place to raise a family. We're here at the Little Belgian Deli in Auburn. This is one of my favorite local places to come grab a sandwich. They have all natural meats, a lot of vegan and gluten-free options, famous stuffed avocados, and 14 craft brews. Why not?